Hello and welcome to Talk Sam. I'm your host Sam Bloomquist, and I have here with me Joe Pitty, of our, the president of our rugby team, who has been very successful this year. Joe, thanks for coming. Thanks for having me. Uh, like I said before, rugby has been very successful as they are undefeated this season and haven't lost a game since last fall. They beat 11th ranked Buff State and beat two other top teams in the conference to be, now be ranked 15th in Division Two. Joe. What do you think are the keys to the success of your season so far? Well, Sam, we got a bunch of really athletic guys that uh, all came up for the team about the same time and then in the second year of the system. So they've gotten past the learning curve, and they're all excelling past our expectations. That's really good. And I know there's a lot of chemistry uh, among the teammates on your team right now, and you, go, you guys go by the alias of the Wolf Pack. Right. The Wolf Pack is kind of like a term that we gave each other, and uh, it's... We got a lot of characters on the team, and you didn't, you wouldn't think that they would blend like the way that they do. But man, when we get on the field together, it's like a wolf pack. We're out to hunt. Yeah, I know a lot of people on the team. You guys seem like you're always having a good time together, whether you're on or off the field. And there's, I can tell that there's a lot of chemistry on this rugby team. So, in order to keep up your success this season, what has to happen for your team, both on and off the field? Well, I think developing that chemistry further. I mean, we got a lot of guys on the team that uh, refuse to lose. They're giving 110% effort just because they love the guy next to them. Uh, I think putting in some new plays and develop and learning the game a little bit more because, I mean, it is a foreign sport, so it is new to a lot of the guys. We only have two guys on the team that have actually played before college, so I think working on those things are really going to take us to the next level. Do you think that experience before college is something that is absolutely necessary to the game, or is it something you can pick up? Uh, I wouldn't say it's necessary, but it definitely helps. Our two mm -hmm. captains are actually the ones that have played before uh, college, one being an All-American from Xavier High School, so that really helps us. So yeah, game an All-American probably would help yeah. the team. Uh, and are there anybody in particular you feel like really takes charge of the team besides yourself as president, of course, as maybe on or off the field they just show that they're a leader on the team? Well, I think a lot of the older guys step up and they take responsibility to set an example for how you should be practicing, the effort you should be giving. But I think the strategy lies in our two captains that played in high school. They actually went to the same high school, uh, Brian Carley and Dean Wilson. They do a lot of our uh, st strategy and game planning for each week. So you got to give them a lot of credit. So as their roles of captains and your role as presidents, how does this differ from each other? Well, the role of captains is uh, really based on uh, planning practices, coming up with game plans for each week, and getting the best 15 players in the field. My role is mainly to make sure that everybody understands the rules that are set down for rec sports. Uh, also, setting a better example off the field for how you should be behaving and how you should be acting in the Quillen community. Setting up some sorts of um, uh, uh, events and fundraisers, mm -hmm. things like that. But other than that, I mean, we're all working together to try and make the team as best as we can be. Joe, I'd like to thank you for coming on the show today. Please follow our rugby team as they go on to the rest of their schedule, which is all the way at Hamilton, at Ithaca, and then at Lemoyne. After their bye week, they go on to play at Oswego. And Joe, we wish you the best of luck this season. Well, Thanks thank for coming you. on the show. Appreciate it. Have a good one, everybody.